I'm standing inside the airport right above where the crash happened around 1.30 this afternoon. And right now you can see and hear crews cleaning up that entrance area. I actually talked to a witness who was sitting right by that entrance on one of those benches you see there. He said he was actually hit by one of the victims who came flying through the glass. And we just got some incredible images sent to us a few minutes ago. Take a look at these up close photos of the accident scene. You can really see the amount of damage it caused to this revolving door and window. There's just glass everywhere. Now we know three people were taken to the hospital. Two suffered serious injuries after police say they were hit by the Jeep on the sidewalk. I'm told the driver had minor injuries. Investigators say the man behind the wheel was unfamiliar with the SUV, which belongs to his brother. It appears it's a four wheel drive vehicle. He grabbed one vehicle, it went in reverse, or one shift lever, it went in reverse, and when he uh, adjusted, he basically punched it and it went in to drive up over the curb. And the man hit his brother and another woman who police say was being helped from a wheelchair to a car. And I just got off the phone with the accident investigator a little bit ago. He has good news. He tells me all of the victims will be okay. They're in non-life threatening condition and we know the brother who was hit is undergoing surgery. Look for more updates on this accident on KETV.com and on our mobile app. Live from Epley Airfield, Camilla Ortiz, KETV Newswatch. Seven. All right.